This disease is killing the coral reefs right here in Florida, and scientists from Moat Marine Lab are scrambling to try to find a solution. News Channel 8's John Rogers joins us now live from Sarasota to explain this is a big deal for our ecosystem, John. It really is. Josh, good evening to you. And I found this kind of interesting. The Florida Reef is the only barrier reef in the continental U.S. and the third largest in the world, and it's in dire need of a rescue. Amongst the colorful scenic coral reefs found off the coast of Florida, researchers from Moat Marine Lab are seeing a sweeping, disturbing trend, white skeletons of dead coral. It's extremely sad to see. Dr. Erin Muller has never seen anything like this. She says over the past couple of years, a mysterious bacteria has been killing much of the coral found off the Florida Keys. Scientists don't know where it came from, and they don't know how to stop it. This particular disease kills corals really quickly. So some corals that we're familiar with because they're 400 years old sometimes can die within a matter of weeks. Coral reefs are more than pretty to look at. They're home to a quarter of the world's marine life, including much of the seafood we eat. And get this, coral reefs have even led to many medicines used to treat diseases like asthma, arthritis, even this, cancer. Uh, this is a dead, the dead area of the coral. Dr. Muller is identifying bacteria-resistant coral yeah. to plant in place of the dead coral. She's optimistic the reef can be saved. Why this particular event has lasted so long compared with others, we're, we're not quite sure yet, but we're hoping that we can solve that mystery in the months to come. So far, this disease is only found off the coast of Florida. The Florida Reef accounts for roughly $6 billion worth of tourism res revenue for this state, so there's an urgency to fix this crisis. Reporting live in Sarasota, John Rogers, News Channel 8.